All right, let's try to emphasize that we're gonna have games for through eight, uh, through eight after the conclusion. I think we lose viewers every time. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It is champion, sorry, championship Monday. It is playoff Monday here in the NACE Rocket League Fall Open. The Emerson College Fish are back. It was a, it was a little, a little touch to go there for a moment, but we will see playoff Rocket League tonight. For the fish. I am Henry, once again joined by the lovely Jay Zim. Hello, hello, excited for some playoff Rocket League. And against Chadron State. Chadron who... State, a, a familiar opponent. Fish faced yep. these guys earlier in the season, lost three to two. And I think we've we've scrimmed against them a couple times. Yep, it's a big playoff Monday. We got two good games here. We got Fish versus Chadron State, and then we got Burnouts versus FSU Black. Don't forget to stick around for that one, starting around 8. Uh, I, I think Emerson may have joined the party a little bit earlier. I'm not sure if we'll be able to... Uh, yeah, I agree. Yeah, okay, okay we'll looks like we are back at this one. Yeah, we're back at this one. All right. yeah, I joined a little, a little prematurely. Didn't let everyone get in. We're gonna back out, and we're gonna, we're gonna try that one again. But this is a best of seven. All previous matches this season have been best of five, but this one for playoffs goes a little bit, a little bit longer. It will take four wins to put yourself through to the, the semifinals. We can only assume that this is going to be a back and forth, extremely good match. I'm very excited. I'm going to go ahead and take a look at this bracket. This is the round of eight. So uh, it's a divisional playoff system between 16 teams. Uh, they are comprised of technically two divisions, but they combine for one. The top four teams in each division advance. So these are the top four, two, uh, top four teams from two different divisions playing in a... Uh, Sort of uh, 
bracket style playoff. Single elimination bracket. Win or win or go home. Hopefully we're gonna get into this very soon. Okay. Take two. Chatham State in the black, Emerson College in the purple. A rematch of the regular season here in the quarterfinals. Jade, who are you looking at here to make a, a big impact on this match? Yay. <laughs> oh, I, I was muted. Sorry. Sorry, I was talking. I was talking. Um, well, obviously, from our side, I'm looking for another great performance from Blue Zoof, who had a um, great performance the last week of the regular season. Uh, definitely the the workhorse for this uh, Emerson College Fish team. But it's going to take all three members to get a playoff win, especially in a best of seven. So I'm also looking for some consistent shooting from Dar, which we've seen late in the season. And uh, some good team play from Benji, who's had a couple nice assists and some uh, good demo work, as well as Dar. Dar's had a lot of assists this season, too. So it's really going to be a team effort. Um, yeah. And then on the other side, yeah, we remember the, the familiar faces of uh, JD Miles, Grim, Grim, Grim Leviathan. Grim Leviathan, yes. Grim Leviathan and, uh, and Fire Angel. Um, so the last time they played. Definitely a different series. It's the regular season. It was a best of five. Mm -hmm. But we did see a reverse sweep for Chadron State. So Emerson College Fish going to have some uh, some ghosts to get rid of here because a reverse sweep hurts. Reverse sweep definitely hurts. Going to try to um, put that one in the back of your mind for sure. Yep. So thank you, for everyone, for watching. This is a big day for the Rocket League program here at Emerson College. Uh, two teams in the playoffs. The first year that both these teams have been in the playoffs, it's also the first year that we've had two teams, but... First year that I think still either team has made. This is the first time that either... that any Emerson College right team has made a playoff format, and both of our teams have made it, so... It's a big day for the program. Very, very exciting. We, we appreciate your, uh, your support, and we know that the Monday Night Football starts at around 8pm tonight, but maybe you can stick around. You know, yeah, I understand. I will be watching Monday Night Football myself after all this, but yeah, don't don't t t touch that dial. T t t directly after this match, we will go t to the Burnouts for their playoff match against Florida State. But here we go, best of seven, game one in the quarterfinals. Pickoff falls to Chattern State. It is J D Miles. Very clear. And fall elusive. By himself in the corner, unchallenged. Up the wall, stopped by Grim Leviathan. Now back down the back down the other way. Benji cuts it out. Not gonna get past Miles. Miles up again, still gets past one. Benji falls on it. Been able to put that one down. Just back and forth. Both teams trying try, trying to get a feel for each other. That one's gonna not quite get get over Miles. Miles. Into the midfield. That's a good clear. Benji just gets back in time and saves save. today. But what a save from Benji. Keeps us alive. Here's Grim Leviathan. No one up. Shot off the bar and taken out slowly. A lot of offense here early on. Counter State. Yes, that shot goes off the bar. And Everson trying to break out here. Early fireworks. Nothing finds yeah. the net. Two shots in the first minute, but you have to feel good if you're Emerson. Neither one of them found the back in the net. Got to stay persistent. That demo's, that demo's not going to do hurt any favors. <laughs> but the shot, not on target. That's a bad open net miss. We saw Emerson uh, be the beneficiary of some of those last week. You can't rely on them all the time. You're going to have to play some stellar defense here. Yeah. Right now, just need to get past this midfield presence as Luziv going to stuff this attack. 
That one's over Dar. Off the backboard. First two, and he's from Leviathan. Still floating. Can Lucif get there? Not quite. JD Miles stuffs him. And Shattered State is on the board first. It's a good hit off the, the top of the backboard there. Uh, Grim Leviathan definitely doing a lot of the work here in the midfield, and at that time just a push up through the middle towards the goal. Overwhelming offense from Chattern State. Emerson trying to break out here as now they're up again. That one is going to go off the post and in for Remus Fire Angel. Opening fireworks have finally found their mark from, from Chattern, and it's up to Emerson to fight back here in game one. Another aggressive kickoff. Is Miles going to get there first? JD Miles not giving Emerson any space to breathe. That's unfortunate. Just pops over the head of Luzu. Dar wasn't expecting it. Can't quite get back in time. And they've been really good on kickoffs this first opening couple minutes. You want to see some strong kickoffs for Emerson. Start changing this game around. It is a long series, though. It is a long series. It might... Look like it's going one way completely right now, but it is Rocket League. This definitely is Rocket League. It's misses from Luziv. And Chess gets by the nose of Benji. Grim Leviathan pouring it on here in game one. Flashes of, 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 of week two. And Emerson could not hold up against this team. Trying to prove it to themselves that that they are beatable but I'm gonna need to put up a little bit more of a fight here that demo for Benji's gonna kick it out to lose it it's past one Dar doesn't want to press on it now it goes but it gets by him Benji get back in time yes saves a fifth now lose over one tries to get past miles that's cut out. And that's going to go over the head of Dar. JD Miles pouring it on here. A fifth goal for Chattered State. Just past the halfway mark of game one. A statement early on. Yeah, this Chattered State team went 6-1, and one, I believe. Emerson being their second toughest challenge, getting two games out of the best of five. So Emerson has to recapture that uh, a couple of those victories that they, they had. And it might not happen this game, Whoa. but we have six more chances, so. Dar's going to get bumped off. Benji gives Emerson some breathing room. Falls to JD Miles all by himself. Tackled by Benji. That challenge is good from Dar. Sit to the middle, taken away by Grim Leviathan. Now Luzif, does he have a passing lane? Cut off by Remus Fire Angel. Emerson had a lot of focus on infield passes in their last couple of matches, and that then has been shut shut down completely. But this one's going to fall into the middle. A miss from one. Dar's got a touch, and Dar's put Emerson on the board. That's what we like to see. Benji's having a great game so far. Uh, you know, relatively, you never want to be down 5-1, but that goal is more important than it might seem right now in a 5-1 game. It's not necessarily just about this game. It's a long series, so you want to see that first goal go in, take some momentum into game two. Just not seeing that big, that big O on the scoreboard. And hopefully, do wonders for Emerson going into game two, but they aren't quite done game one yet. Now Dar breaks out. He, he has a lot of boost. Takes it into the corner. Now JD Miles pops it over Luzu. And back down the other way. Grim Leviathan not going to be able to put this one on target. It's going to try to find a teammate in the middle. It's JD Miles. It's Grim Leviathan. And it's Grim Leviathan. By himself. Wow. Wow, eh? I'm not sure if I was seeing these plays from them last time out. It was very early on in the season, but. Uh, they have really. That is. They've really stepped up as a team here. Now looking for a seventh. It is JD Miles. Cut off by Luzu. 
Benji is gonna not make contact. Oh, Tadar. Dunked by Remus, Fire Angel, and unfortunately... Uh, the one thing that might be worse than... Than... Getting... Getting shut out has happened. It's a Brazil in game number one. Seven to one score line. Not easy to bounce back from, and Everson's gonna try their best. As that touch from Benji nice finds the net. Missed touch on defense. That's seven one score line deleted. Yeah, I thought Benji's had uh, easily the best game on the purple side of the ball here this so far. They're gonna need um, a lot more consistency from everyone and just a lot of fight because this is not a way you want to lose game one, but this is just one game. You gotta erase it, build on what works. Um, you know, try to get more warmed up. You know and uh, match some of the mechanics from the Shatter on State side, as this one might be 8th, and it is. It's going to be up to the, the, the fish coaches, Spicy Bricey and Michael, to try to, to, to talk to their team, figure out what's working and, and what isn't, get them back on the road. Yeah, one thing I don't like is... Uh, three people on the same side of the field on that last goal, but I also don't like that Elusive doesn't seem to be too involved here with the good clear there. I want to see some more aggressiveness from Emerson's uh, goal lead goal scorer for the regular season. No touch for Miles. Dar picks up a, a third. That's consolation. Again, you've scored three goals. That's you know some games that's going to win you the game, right? So. All about that, that's something to take away. Step up. Yeah. Right, right. Yep. As this game will come to an end right about now, Chattered State takes a convincing game one victory, 8 to 3. How can Emerson bounce back? You know, one thing I do like about Collegiate Rocket League, all GGs in the chat despite the 8 3 scoreline. <laughs> you like to see that. I like to see that. And. Look, Emerson don't see that held else. to only three shots, but all three of their shots went in. Whereas Chattered State, just overwhelming offense. 15 shots. Yeah, and if, I, if my math is correct, that means they only had two misses. Because five of them were saves. Yeah. Just so. Great shooting from Chattered State. And their mechanics, you know, of course, I, I didn't really uh, re-watch the, the the regular season match between these two teams. But I think their mechanics do look much improved, so definitely might be a surprise here. Ch Chad and State looks very good here. They are clicking on all cylinders. We get into game two. It's all about how can Emerson adapt. And that's big right there, winning a kickoff, because that I was something that was not happening. Yeah. Immediate good start. Another thing that was playing Emerson was, it was pushing a little too far up on offense and then getting caught out. Let's see if this an early mm. goal could help them out. Lose finds bottom corner, but it's out. And I like that aggressiveness. I want to see Loser get more touches, especially on offense. Obviously, you don't want to see over committing, but... Like that, a double commit is going to leave a hole, but JD Miles, with a clean opportunity, skies out the crossbar. That team bump is going to not end up biting Emerson. And a little a little back and forth again. Some good chances for both sides now, but neither. It's a great clear. Find the net. Dar takes out Miles. Benji. Put it in the corner. This midfield presence from Chattern State has been so good as Grim Leviathan can't get a touch off the backboard. And a big clear from Benji as, oh, JD Miles reads it at midfield. Still, a brick wall camped out on the halfway line. Will not allow Emerson to push down the field. Benji's going to try again. JD Miles again shuts him down and now takes to the skies, taken down by one. And Emerson finally got a big clear out of his. 80 miles. 
collect the mid-boost. Dar can get a touch. Now Benji. Dar's bumped back into Benji. But Luzif finally gonna get a little bit of breathing room. See if Everson can fit. make something out of this. Nice hit from Benji. Collected on the backward by Miles. Takes it by himself. Benji saves the day again. JD Miles has looked great in the air. That is going to be on target. Taken away by Benji. Now Dar, back down the other way. Can't get a good recovery. JD Miles up again. That's off the backboard. Falling to the middle. There first is Benji. Takes out Rick Grim Leviathan. Defense looking better from Emerson. Still need to break out here. I almost wonder if someone is taking JD Miles' controller because I just don't remember these types of mechanics. This is a much improved game from Shadowrun State, and it's really fun to watch. But we got to get Emerson some goals here, especially deep into this game, too. We're going to need the first fish goal oh, and the lead. Now. But a clear goes all the way down the field. Emerson's going to be able to respawn and actually lose him. With there half, we go. Half the game gone. Two demos, Luzif the only Emerson player left on the field, but left alone for just a little bit too long. And at the halfway point, Emerson has the lead. Every game is different. And if you're watching at home, demos aren't everything. You know, you can demo both players, you might still give up a goal. The ball is the most important thing. And you just love to see a lead here for Emerson after that first game. Every game is different. It's a long series. Now, can they hold it or add to it? Star, put off the sidewall. Luzif back on defense. Oh no, a misread. And Luzif took a little bit too much time, got in his head. The game is tied. That's really unfortunate for Luzif. Oh no, <laughs> thought he had more time. Just bounced over. Oh, that's a momentum killer. Got to shake it off though. Yeah. And the mentality, fish here, overcome. A little bit of a glaring mistake. Got shot, turned away by the Emerson defense. It's just like any other sport. Mistakes ultimately win and lose games. So just limit those, make your team, make your opponent rather beat you, and don't beat yourself. It's a big theme in the NFL, especially. Big theme in Rocket League as well. Now Chatter, trying to get this offensive push going again. Elusive. Can't quite make contact. Goes in for more. JD Miles puts it in the middle. Dar's alone. The bump is going to take out Dar and regain the lead for Chadron State. JD Miles puts it in the middle and just slams Dar away from the play. In a hole once again, but wow, the last one what was this? Was a five goal one. This is only one. Hopefully, it doesn't become two as it bounces off the crossbar. Grim Leviathan there for a follow up. Taken away. That's actually over the head of GD Miles. Can he get back in time? Just off the post. Dar for the follow up. And it's good enough for a goal. Benji catches the defense, pushed too far up. GD Miles can only put it off the post. And Dar's there. There we go. I was muted again. Oh my <laughs> goodness. Yeah, watch What a goal. Let's go. That is on target. Luzif can't quite get there in time. A powerful shot from JD Miles. Catches Emerson out of net, and it seems like every time Emerson creeps back up, Chatter has an answer. Now Dar. Just to the corner. It's not a great touch from Remus. That one. Gonna go still waiting in the middle. Luzif taken out on the back line, but Benji there to there. Hold the line. Gets it over JD nice. Miles. No. Mo. Gonna... Still a little bit of pressure here. Benji. Beat yeah, by Fire Angel, and Dar is not going to be able to make contact. Elusive, trying to hold on on defense. Leviathan, demoed off the field. Now JD Miles versus Benji. It's up, and it's over! And may, what may be the dagger for game two, JD Miles. 
Dadrin's MVP so far. A much closer game. Much harder fight. But looking like the outcome will be the same. Emerson getting closer. So with 10 seconds to go, down two goals. They need one right now. JD Miles on the ball. That Unlikely to happen. Actually, a miss. With time on the clock, no. Fire Angel shuts him down and chatter, and it's up 2 0. Uh, that, I'm not going to lie, that one's a heartbreaker because they had a really good shot at taking that game. That just hurts. And now you can't lose the next one. No. You know, not every, not every team is going to. Sorry, go ahead. Reverse sweeps are extremely uncommon, but a little bit more shooting, and definitely a lot less shooting from yeah from, from Chattern State held to eight shots. Oh, it was a much better game from the fish perspective. I I really do agree, and obviously the adjustments worked. Oh, but man, a couple a couple you know a couple mistakes really could have yeah could have kept that game tied. So it's really just about forgetting that, and you know playing. You know, giving the same effort, trying to to match uh, Chad around, get a couple wins here. You have to put those mistakes in the back of your mind. Benji, not going to get the boost. And taken out of the play by GD Miles. He then misses the ball. Emerson's going to have first strike here. And if they get a chance into the middle, Benji pops it up. Dar's still nice there. Lose of goes. Gets a touch on it. It's still dangerous. It's a huge oh. touch. That might have been a goal at the other end. JD Miles up to Grip Leviathan. He's going to put it down the middle. Two go for Emerson. They're going to stop this push. Now Luzov gets it over nice. one. Grip Leviathan just back in time. Now, back and forth once more. Did Emerson get caught out on defense? Yes, they did. Pushed up too far. That's been the name of the game for Chadron. Pushed up a little too far on offense. And that's a Kinda of slotted that one. Yeah, that was top 90 for sure from a long shot. It's a good clear there. And they might have had one before if it wasn't for elusive uh, uh, almost near 50. So now we've got to watch the long balls. It seems like to be a part of their attack right now. Shot from Grimm Leviathan. Turned away. GD Miles. This is out to Dar. Two go, but GD Miles. Buying time. And... You know, demoed for his efforts. Dar, can he get around in time? Yes, he can. Still battling for it, trying to put it center. But JD Miles collects. Can't get a second touch, though. Now we're stuck in the midfield once again. Trying to push forward. That's, that miss from JD Miles is going to give them an opportunity. Dar, Could be something. 50 in the middle. Vyth keeps in the corner. Now the passing play just misses the nose of Grim Leviathan. But the follow-up shot is taken away by Dar. Now Grim Leviathan. Saved by Benji. Can they get the ball out of their half for but a moment? Breathe. And that demo on Grim Leviathan is going to help out. Benji tries to get a bump. But no go. Another long clear. This time, Dar's there for it. Nice, Dar. Nice, Dar. And the follow-up shot saved by Elusive. There we go. I'm, I'm really liking the the resiliency shown by Emerson, and I think, I think Chatterin's spacing has been really difficult to deal with. Absolutely. Um, they're just very well spaced Ooh, that's out. That's unfortunate. Oh, but a miss from the life, and Emerson gets gets away with one. A double commit on defense had them a little stranded. A shot's on nice target. Shot. Oh, oh, what a save. JD yeah, Miles. That was, good, that was a good attempt. Gonna put this one back out. Best chance of the game so far for Emerson. Goes off the mark. And now, caught off again. Elusive. Back in time. Fire Angel. That one. Side. Benji, long clear. See if they can do anything about this. 
<laughs> Went for the demo there, I think. From Leviathan. Mm. Waiting up top. Falls in the middle. The bump onto Dar is gonna keep this push going from Chatter, but that touch might end it. Another double commit from Emerson. There, I think nerves might be getting them a little bit. But. But they've played really well this game. They just need one goal to give them a shot. You really want to take this and game. That could be and that's a great demo. What a play. <laughs> what a play. The physical play for Benji shows up on the biggest moments. Adar puts one in the back of the net. We are tied with a minute 22. This is a game that Emerson so desperately need. Benji might have just bopped their way in. Going for two. Stopped mm. by Grim Leviathan. I'm loving how Benji's playing this series so far. It's been fun to watch. Oh, that was extremely close. Just tipped off by Luzu. And now, pass in the middle. A touch by Dar. It's really dangerous. Luzu saves the day. Up next is JD Miles. Shoots off target. Deals their boost, but that challenge with Dar. Gonna take the pressure off. Another demo for Benji. He's figured out how he wants to win this game. Shot from Lucive, saved. Oh. Yeah, just hit it right at him. A little unfortunate, but definitely a game plan. Sort of what we saw last week, right? Benji's really going ahead of the play and trying to get some demos. Oh, saved by Dar. 25 seconds left. Both teams with good chances. Will we see overtime in game three? Leviathan. The back Challenged pass. by Dar. Now Benji up for it. Beats JD Miles. Well, I'm liking this one, Henry. Could go into the middle, but Fire Angel is going to shut this one down. Five seconds left now. Grim Leviathan can't make contact. And that will probably, once this ball hits the ground, we have overtime in game number three. This is a huge moment for Emerson here. 2 1 or 3 0. That touch from Fire Angel. Put them on the defense. Please, if cleans up. Oh. Has some space. Aggressive. Falls to Grim Leviathan, but Benji is there. In the middle. Looks like for above. Oh! 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 Came out to Benji. Couldn't react in time. Now back down the other way. JD Miles, no boost. Puts it on target. Darn, lose it. Oh no! Oh no! Panic from the Emerson defense. And the shot on target. Lose it, Dar. Miscommunication. Oh, that one hurts. There's nothing to say about that. That's just oh, tough. no. That's tough. Oh, they played so well that game, too. Heartbreak and finished game three. And that was just JD Miles' second shot, and it really wasn't a good shot. So they had really played uh, JD Miles really tough that game. So it's really. Oh, the last two games, a lot of hard work just. I, bet, I think it's probably three own goals that have really just hurt them. A lot of work, and but nothing to show for it. And now, a monumental task ahead. Four games in a row needed to, to keep the Emerson College Fish's season alive. As this series, of on, they, series goes on, they have looked better and better. And can they turn the corner here? As words being said by both coaches. Trying to get their players ready for game number four. For what could be the final game of the Emerson College Fishes Emerson College Fishes season. For all of you at home and on the field, we want to see this series keep going. Game number four. To stay alive. Fairly neutral kickoff. Caught out, and it's just to be off the bar. Falls into the middle. Dar and Benji combine. Pop it back mid. It's over the head of Leviathan, but Fire Angel is there. Now Luzif. 
another scary touch that cleans this one up himself. That one's not quite on target. The follow up from JD Miles will be though. Emerson looks shaky here in the start of game four. Yeah, that pass doubles as a dummy as he sort of. Grim Leviathan tries to go for the bump and leaves it to JD to f finish up. Probably not much chance at saving that one. Good play. Finally, a face off win, but Remus gets there first, so not really. Demo on to Luzu. What? Can Emerson muster up here? Get out of trouble. This is scary, and it's over the head of Benji. A clear not hard enough. And yeah, it's so tough. Emerson might not be able to get out of their heads about that game three loss. Proven to hurt them here. But Yeah, I was going to say, that, that's super tough when that happens, and then you got to go play a game four in which you're down 3-0. Now here is Dar. Gets a demo. Benji puts that one on our target. Remus just gets back in time. We are not done yet. Four minutes on the clock. Luziv puts it over one. Remus, Fire Angel, nothing he can do about it. And Everson says, not so fast. Yeah, great pass by Benji. Good reaction time by Luziv there. And you got to be thankful that Remus was the one trying to recover that one because I think uh, Grim Leviathan or JD Miles would have had a better chance at it. So that, that's a good sign. We got one goal there. Great kick Just off. Want, take one game at a time. And one goal at a time as the pass gets a little harder. JD Miles has been untouchable on these kickoffs. I think JD Miles might know how to do like that. Know how to do a speed flip or something. He has been full been a on, lot of delays. Full on winning these, these kickoffs. And see, look, again, Dart is unable get a hand on the ball as these kickoffs proving absolutely deadly as getting away with one here. All three players combined. Put this one back middle. From the Vizens. Guys it back in. It's gonna fall dangerously. And still dangerously. Fire Angel misses. Dar's gonna get a big clear though. Three and a half minutes left. The fish to pull out two goals. Full boost. Tackled by Grim Leviathan. And the demo on Benji is going to slow this play down. On the respawn, That's Benji it. gets a good clear. Going to try to take it himself. Gets it over one oh. off the crossbar. The fall of Dark. Nice shot, saved though. by JD Miles. Oh, that was a really good chance there. But now, back down the other way. Going to have to get on defense. Falls to Fire Angel. Not not quite the touch he wanted from Leviathan. It's going to combine to get into the middle. It's still dangerous. The demo <laughs> just wasn't on target, thankfully. I think Bill. this next goal next is goal the most is so important huge. one of the series. As that's not quite on target, half the game left now. Lucif takes out Fire Angel. Dar punts it down the field. 80 miles. Keeps it in the corner. Falls out to Benji. It's over the head of Fire Angel. No one there for the follow-up, though. JD Miles versus Lucid now. JD Miles takes to the skies. Gets another what? touch. Goes for a bump. Can't get it. Where did that come from? But now Benji. <laughs> goes for a demo. Got demoed himself. Two minutes now. Fire Angel. Taken it out by Lucid. But a good 50-50 for JD Miles. Trying to put the icing on the cake here. Game number four. Benji gets it behind Luzev. He's going to play it off to Dar, but it's going to be awkward. Luzev going to take himself over one, but gives up on it. Dar there now. JD Miles beats them both. Can he put it on target? It's over two. It's not in yet. And it's going to not fall in. Flirting with fire. Just over a minute now. JD Miles. Oh my goodness. He is flying all of a sudden. Been everywhere today. Been everywhere Absolutely. today. Definitely their most important piece on this team from today. Just today, at least. You know, we haven't been watching them all season, but 
Um, I do, I do still like uh, the fight that, that the fish have showed here. I mean, to, to lose the first game eight three and then play basically every game since close. Mm -hmm. um, this one not over yet. Gina Miles doesn't get a good touch. He doesn't, but the follow up save. What can you do? Thirty five seconds now. Two goals still needed. Desperation time for the fish. Chattered State looking to cruise into the semifinals. Now, another touch middle. 80 miles. Harrison needs a goal mm. now. Eight seconds left. Lusive into the middle. JD Miles pops it up, and with three seconds what? left. What? Where is that? What? That is okay. gonna do it. A four to zero victory for Chattern State. Ends the Emerson College Fishes season. A great run, but fell short in the quarterfinals. The in, in, in inaugural season for the Emerson College Fish has come to a halt. A great showing. A tough first game, but really fought back in, in, in all the rest. And congratulations to, to Chattern State. They are moving on to the divisional semifinals. Yep. And if we can reflect on the on the fish season so far, I thought it was obviously very positive. I mean, in the first the first year as a team, a lot of these a lot of these players have a lot of time left with Emerson Esports. So just really uh right a nature. lot to build on here. A, a lot to build on right here and um you got to love Rocket League. I had a great time announcing these games uh for this team this season with you, Henry. Me too. It's um it's been, it's been it's been a blast. Yep. Very proud of this team and this uh uh this program and we have another game at 8, so please stick around. Don't touch that dial. The stream is is going to go down, but at 8 p.m. it is time for the burnouts playing their 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 quarterfinal match against Florida State. A good showing from the fish. We'll see you next season. From from Henry and Jay signing off.